This is Mark the Meerkat in with FreeOnlineTradingEducation.com brought to you by Grok Trade, where I'm an analyst, host to the Grok Star Trading Room, and perhaps your future mentor. Let's take a look at a trade that we had on VRX in the Grok Star Room this morning. Yeah, VRX again. This has been a very active stock the last couple of months. We only had one trade on today, but I thought it was a nice lesson to teach here. Again, this is a one minute chart. It was running up here and then pulling back in this channel which was actually tightening just a little bit this is called a bull flag if you want to know more about what a bull flag is you can go to our site freeonlinetradingeducation.com and go right up here to chart school it's free and then look under chart patterns and we go to chart patterns in there here we are we want to take a look here at a bull flag that's it right here and we tag on that and here's a picture of it where it ran up and now it's coming back in a parallel channel. This is a bullish pattern. If it breaks out above here, odds are in our favor. You can read about it here. You can even print it off and uh, study it. And then here's some examples. These are daily charts. So this happens at all time frames. There's a daily chart. Look at that. It broke right out nicely up here. It's getting ready to. And here's a couple of charts from my uh, day trading you on one minute charts again same thing happens happening over and over again at different times so let's take a look at this one on VRX and here we are ran up it's in this parallel channel here and let's uh, set a trade here if it breaks out we want to get in and that's when the odds go in our favor and boom there she goes look at that broke right out and I am now long here at 2772 on VRX and look at the volume down here. Look how it rocketed up here to a quarter of a million shares in one minute here. So let's take a look at it. Continue to follow through. So I'm going to set a stop but right now. It's up about 1%. I'm going to pull my stop just inside the money here. I have zero risk on this trade. Boy, I love it when that happens. Now look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, six up channels in a row. And now we're coming up to this line here now this one down here this is the r1 pivot line this is the r2 resistance line one resistance line two for pivot lines which is in a interday possible line of support and resistance and it's running up to this and it also has six of them up in a row average leg up is uh, four to six look at that boom 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 bringing my stop up behind this eight ema here i'm going to put my stop right here underneath this eight ema it went up it did pierce that pivot line pull back just a little bit just keeping my stop there and bam there it goes pierced it and stopped me out at 2828 so let's take a look at this trade it was a bull flag as soon as it broke out and with increased volume just confirmed it and then the sucker ran up here and then it started to do a pull a pullback so I put my stop just underneath this 8 EMA and stopped me out for 2% in 12 minutes Hoo -ah. So the lesson here is this is a one minute chart for a day trade and this bull flag. Well, guess what? This happens in all time frames. So if you're a swing trader and each of these bars is now a day, these things also happen in that and you just manage it the same way. Difference between that and my day trading is you make a decision once a day with your swing trading. I make a decision once a minute with my day trading. This is Mark the Meerkat. Hey, just remember that. Good trading is not about being right. It's about trading right. If you want to be a successful trader, you need to think of the long run and ignore the outcomes of individual trades. Trade well.